It seems as though the police never learned that filming them on a public sidewalk is perfectly legal and now one overzealous officer will be paying the price. The New York City police officer that arrested a New York Times photographer has been indicted on three felony counts and five misdemeanor counts for fabricating the cause of the arrest. Officer Michael Ackerman, 30, was charged with tampering with public records, falsifying business records, official misconduct and making a false written statement, police told CBS New York. If convicted, he faces termination from his job at the NYPD. If convicted of the most serious charge alone, tampering with evidence, he faces up to seven years in prison. On August 4, 2012, Ackerman arrested 44-year-old Robert Stilarik, a New York Times photographer who was taking pictures of a police response to a fight in the Concourse neighborhood of the Bronx. Stilarik was later charged for obstructing government administration by repeatedly using his flash and violently resisting arrest by harming the officer with his camera. According to a probe by prosecutors and the NYPD's Internal Affairs Bureau, the photographer never used his flash and did not even have one on his camera at the time of the incident. No witnesses reported seeing a flash and the photos taken during the arrest show that no flash had been used. Officer Ackerman was arraigned for fabricating details about the incident. The NYPD officer was charged with three felony counts and five misdemeanor counts, and all charges against the photographer were dropped.